Hey guys, it's Kyle here. I'm from Tennessee and I am currently in Beilun District in Ningbo City. Today I got to give a speech in Chinese to the entire student body about the independent lifestyle that we are raised in in America. <laughs> Just to show you guys how close everything is, this is my building right here behind me, right? That's the supermarket. If I need anything for my kitchen, my bathroom, cleaning supplies, everything right there. This is the fruit store that I go to. And then right at the end of this block, about right here, is a really good restaurant. There's a bakery right there, all within five seconds of walking out my front door. Pretty cool. All right, so I just got back from the store. All right, guys, look at these prices. This huge potato, I have three sweet potatoes. Yes, three renminbi. B. That's 50 cents. I got this huge pack of peppers. It's about 520 renminbi. That's less than a dollar. Now this. 33 Remy B. A little over $5 for this huge bag of chicken and this huge thing of spinach. I got three packs of it here. That's only still less than one US dollar. So, all that cheap, good, healthy food. Another really cool thing I got to do was. Um, I got to teach an English class to all the teachers of my school. Where is the bathroom? Where is the bathroom? Uh, I put together a couple sentences and a couple scenarios for them, and we went into this really nice conference room and put my lecture up on the PowerPoint in the back, and about 40, 50 teachers came into the came into the conference room and I led them in an English class. I believe there's a bank on the next street over. I believe there's a bank on the next street over. It was pretty interesting. We had a vacation at the beginning of uh, this month, October 1st to 7th. I went to Shanghai and uh, got to catch up with some really good friends. Um, I even attended a EDM festival called Storm. It was amazing. Well, that was a little peek into the last month or two here uh, that I've been in China. Thank you guys for watching. I will definitely be recording more videos, taking more pictures in the future, and uh, really enjoying my time here in Ningbo. Thank you.